Today, we are glad to introduce our latest 3D printer, EQFAB L4D. In this video, we will introduce you on how to add the support for the models, which is critical to a successful print. As you can see, if we put the models in this direction, it is not possible to print this way. So, we need to add supports. In most cases, as long as you choose an appropriate direction to place the model, adding the support with auto support function is enough. The software will automatically detect the lowest point, boundary and space between each point. For solid models such as light ortho models, adding support is non-mandatory. For hollow models, whether adding support is needed depends on if they have drain holes. You need to add support for models that don't have drain holes. If no support is added, the model will have a cup structure, which can affect the printing accuracy. For hollow models with drain holes, you can print it directly without support added. For surgical guide modes, we need to be careful about the direction the service that contacts the patient should not be added with any support. So, you need to flip the model and make sure the support is added on the uncontacted service. When we rotate the model, the estimated printing time will change as the height of the printed model has been changed. After the support is generated, we also need to make sure that there is no support point in those tunnels. <laughs> 